What is going on, guys? It's Reflex here, and I literally just got off work. And, I mean, one, it's been a very long minute since I've actually sat down and recorded something. Because normally when I have, like, this kind of long break, I'm still recording. I'm just not uploading what I record just to kind of stay in the groove. But it's literally been, like, however long it's been since I've uploaded, that's how long it's been since I've even recorded something. But we finally got something Kingdom Hearts related. Now... I honestly forgot a lot about Union Cross. I think I even skipped the last, like, quest that happened. Like, I don't even think I remember what happens. But this is part one, I think, to the finale. Like, the last final part of Union Cross. Which, I mean, say what you want about Union Cross. The story that came from this game has been godlike. And I am honestly kind of excited to see what's going to come from, you know, this update. So, shouts out to Everglow. You know, hopefully this is recording right, because this also, I don't really record my screen on the computer normally ever, so this is kind of the first time I'm doing it in a while, but let's just get right into this and see what we got. I'm excited. Oh god, okay, that hurt my ears a little bit. That was loud. That was loud. Twas loud. It's Yes, it was. I'm excited though. 20 minutes? Goddamn. That's how long these quests be? Jeez. I mean... Uh, that ain't bad. Uh, I'm looking forward to this. I'm going to... If you guys are avid Union Cross, like, either players or just you have watched a lot, please let me explain everything that happened in this down below so I get an idea of what's happening, just in case I'm confused. All right. I hope everything's okay. I'm sure it is. Lorium knows it wasn't Vin's fault, right? Oh, yeah, that's where we... Okay, I kind of remember. Should we check on them? Yes, you should. No, Lorium said everything was fine. Okay. For 20 minutes, this got to be some meaty stuff. Do you really think the world is going to end? Oh, yeah, didn't they? They did drop a lot of information last uh, update, so I forgot. But yes, just catch me up in the comment section below because... At least from the last two updates, I need to know all the story, including this one. Because I'm trying to figure out everything. That when this world is shrouded in darkness, it'll just go to sleep. Because aren't they, isn't like the ones that we're seeing right here, aren't they in the data version of Daybreak Town? Or am I wrong about that? Because isn't there an actual data version that Lucio is watching them from? And then an actual like you know the regular world version that's where the master masters and you know darkness and lushu are i think could be wrong <laughs> that's so much for kingdom hearts obviously there's a lot to look you know kind of figure out i'm liking what i'm seeing so far though i wonder how many answers we're gonna get thank you for always being there scold is that how you pronounce that i don't watch enough theory videos where they actually pronounce Names. Ooh, who's walking up? Oh, hi there. Who we seeing? Oh, of course. Our Lorium and Ventus. I'm sorry, Ventus. I know it wasn't your fault. I just needed someone to blame. Darkness is so abstract. My anger needed a simple, tangible target. Selfish of me, I know. But some emotions are too much to bear. Tell me, is darkness really gone? Or has it become a part of you? Just like you said. Which, we kind of know the answer. If it has, then I... Oh, what's happening? Hatred, anger, and sadness. That's exactly what they want. Is that Strelitzia? You have to let... Oh, it is. Isn't this Loki said? What happened to my kind and loving brother? Oh, I'm about to cry. Strelitzia? Who is it? Lorium, someone's here to see you. Who? Oh. Nice. Elrena. Larxene makes an appearance. Obviously, El Reyna is her real name. What are you doing here? Well, I thought you should know. It's about Streletzia. Chirithi claims to have seen her. Really? That's interesting. 
You saw my sister? Where? Maybe it wasn't her, but a few days ago. Oh, this shit's about to get meaty. Wait a minute. Charithes really do just be knowing all of Kingdom Hearts. They just be seeing shit. Whoa. I spotted someone who looked an awful like her headed toward town from the hill. And she wasn't alone. She was with someone in a black coat. Either Lushu or Master Masters. Probably Lushu. But how? I love that uh, theme, by the way. Same with this one, actually. Hmm. We can't be sure of anything yet. But it's definitely an interesting piece of information. A black coat could only mean one of the Keyblade Masters? Most likely. Both the Master of Masters and Lushu fit the description. But the Masters shouldn't be here. Even if this were the real world. Okay, so they are in a data world. Wait a minute, maybe. Or are they? What is it? Do you remember why this data world was created? As a backup to the real one? Right. To save the world as it was before the Keyblade War. That means Streletsia's data must be stored here too. Really? I thought this place was just a copy of the world, not its people. Besides, if everyone's data was brought over, shouldn't there be versions of us here too? Yep. Our data shouldn't or our data should be here as well. Could be that it's still locked up and hasn't been touched yet. Interesting. Think about it. Arena saw a glitched version of Streletsia. If what Chirithi says is true, maybe her data is here and someone managed to access it. Man, brain really using his brain. It's crazy. I don't understand. Why Streletsia? And if her data does exist, does that mean we can bring her back? I don't know. Who would do something like that? Well... As far as we know, all the masters are gone. We'll probably have more luck finding answers in the real world. Hmm. I see. About that, if what Darkness said was true, we should be able to use the lifeboat in the basement to get back. It's crazy that the thing from Kingdom Hearts 1 is literally being such a pivotal role now in Union Cross. Like, that's nuts to me. We don't have time to think about that now. Come on, let's go to the the basement. Name was this attack on Titan? <laughs> the answers are in the basement. Would you mind carrying Vin? Not at all. All right, it's, it's about to get juicy. It's already getting juicy now. These past two up or quests, I should say, have been nuts. And he's also an interesting character right now because we've seen him wield what was Ericus's Keyblade, so. Makes you wonder. All right, one, two, three, four, five. There's five light boat lifeboats. I don't know who you sent, but there are five left. Who will they go to? You didn't read that part of the book. It wasn't of any interest to me. So what is then? Expansion. I don't get you. <laughs> Nor we you. That didn't flaw off my tongue, right? That sounded weird. You spent time gro whoa, <laughs> grooming these builders only to trap and leave them behind in the data world. Why? Don't know. Who knows that or who knows what the master of masters is thinking? And yet you follow him. Why not? I may not know the reasoning behind everything he does. But I can guess. But you're not certain? No. But I am sure of one thing. He is not a fan of darkness. I see. That we understand. 
We're not fond of light either. I wonder what is Master Masters? Is he an ally or a villain? So what's your brilliant plan? To spread throughout the data world using his signals. To accompany the chosen one into the future so I can lay claim to the worlds not yet created. Right, expansion. So no matter what world or time I end up in, you'll be there too, huh? I don't think so. Oh, oh, there we go. I thought you were told not to interfere. Yeah, to help the dandelions. But I'm not doing this for them. I'm doing this for me. I am formless. You cannot destroy me. I know. Then why waste the effort? The longer you exist without a tangible form, the more your will fades. Darkness had form when the Master of Masters was a boy, right? You abandoned it to defeat light. That's when darkness became a whole. But then you realized that you couldn't maintain your will as one or as a whole. Which is why you still need a physical form. You call it infection and expansion, but you're just stealing the bodies of those with hearts. Interesting. You act like this is a grandiose plan when an actually kind of sad and pathetic. Lushu going crazy. Silence. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> you never even figured out his real plan, did you? What? Let me ask you this. Besides you, there are five other shadows with individual will. I know at least one is in the data world. So where are the other four? Is it Larxene, Demix, Luke Sword, and Marluxia? I wonder. <laughs> After which we found ourselves in the data world. But you are, but you return to the real world with evil, f with the evil fairy, meaning the rest are still there. Yes. Then you're the only one in my way. As you are in mine. Are we about to see a battle go on? Oh shit. Dang, it's all, everything's all messed up. I count six. Excuse me. Hmm. So someone's gonna have to stay back. Ah, so two people. Wait, um, whoever's in the comment section, can you guys let me know why is this one destroyed? Do we know why? Because I seem to have... Something's not clicking. Because I know Maleficent stole one. But I don't necessarily remember everything. What's he up to? Oh, gosh. Huh. Man, it's low-key kind of scaring me. <laughs> We're running out of time. We need to decide who goes. But we're not the only dandelions. I wonder who they're going to pick. Because obviously... Is the green-haired dude beside... Uh, what's How do you pronounce his name? Ephemera or whatever? Is that the player? Or no? When all is shrouded in darkness, the world will fall into slumber. Right. I'm assuming that's the player. The Master of Masters knew this would happen and created a backup of the world. 
a place to shelter and keep us safe. That's where we are. So are these data of them or is this like they're actual beings that they've been thrown into? Then the end of this world is nothing like the end of the real one. Like I said, sleep mode. So it's not this world we need to be worried about. It's the real world. Even if we use the lifeboat to get back, we'll have to use it again to go wherever it is we need to go after. And who knows where that will be? Well, we know three of which. Ventus, Larxena, Marluxia, or Ventus, um, Lorium, and Elorena. We know that they ended up into the world we know, at least. Right, but if no one goes back, then no one there will know what happened here. There'll be no rescuing anyone left behind. And we can't let that happen. We Keyblade wielders need to live on. Ephir okay, hold on. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that right now. <laughs> Brain. You should go back. Having you in the real world will give us the best chance to save the people here. Got it. I'm not a union leader or anything, so... Listen, the only way to make it out of this is to go back. We're the ones responsible for this whole situation in the first place. So you, Vin, and... Okay, so that is the player, Everglow. Got it. I, I got confused. I was like, if Everglow's in the game, but then I realized. <laughs> oh, they're all. Jeez. Okay, so if there's a chance you'll get your sister back, then you need to be there for her. Besides, you'll have a better chance of finding answers over there. You should take it. All right, so this is getting interesting. If this is part one, I can't imagine what part two is going to be. It's weird how much opposite she is of Lark scene. <laughs> like, it's crazy. There's only one way out of here, and the seating's limited for now. When I get back, I promise I'll find a way to save everyone here. Thanks. All right, we don't have much time. How much longer is this? Oh, we still got four minutes. Who's going? I'll stay. Also, the player's staying. I'm not even a dandelion. <laughs> I'm just here as your friend. So if you're staying, so am I. Oh, shoot. Let me get this off the screen. There we go. Besides, I don't want to have to wait around for you again. Our player has really been through some stuff. Because... I mean, I kind of forget the whole story even before a Union Cross, like Unchained Key. I forget. Like, isn't that the same player? I'm not sure. But that'd be... That'd be dope if, like, our main character from here ended up, like, somehow playing a pivotal role later. Even though I guess he plays a pivotal role now, technically. Then it's settled. Lorium, can you look after Vin? All right. Well. Interesting. Oh, let's go with this music. Let's go. There's that, there's that Keyblade. Interesting. Also interesting. Huh. But if you're ever lost, don't hesitate to have a look. And he comes in clutch later. It'll help when you need it most. He comes in clutch major and Kingdom Hearts 3. Well, they all do, pretty much. It's dope. But as far as I'm concerned, they still belong to you. Master Ava entrusted them to you for a reason. 
I thought you'd be happy. <laughs> Master Ava told me you've been wanting to read the book for a long time. Besides, I'm pretty sure she gave these to me knowing I would just do this, or I would do just this. May your heart be your guiding key. Ephemer? Is that how you pronounce that? Just like mine is for me. May your heart be... That's, that's like my favorite quote. I don't know why. It holds so much as value. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to say that shit in public. Be at work and just... It's a tough day. It's like, ah. May my heart be my guiding key. <laughs> Everglow, are you sure about this? Yep. I'm right where I want to be. Alright, so we got three people in the data world. We got Brain, Lorium, Elrena, Ventus going to um going to the real world. So this is interesting because there's still one pod and there's three people. I want to say a theory of mine would be Oh, that's it? That sure is. Well, we'll pause it right here for now. Well, actually, no, hold on. We'll, we'll pause it on this screen. Um, So, I want to say my theory, because obviously I'm in no just realm to make theories. How do I get this off? Hold on. Ah, get off my screen, you weenie. Ah, it's not going to happen. I'm too tired. But my theory is that maybe the player... We'll end up using... Well, no. Because... Ephemer... I know I'm saying that name wrong and I hate it. Probably. But we know he ended up in Kingdom Hearts 3. So maybe... Unless he had another way of getting out. But I feel like... It's either... He gets out... By using the last lifeboat. Or... The player gets out. But I'm pretty sure it's probably him. Because it just makes sense. It lines up perfectly. But still, we got Brain, Ventus, Lorium, and Lorena. But what's confusing is, have we seen Demix or Luxord in Union Cross at all? Because that's one thing that's interesting. We have not seen them in any way, shape, or form yet, I don't believe. If we have, let me know what quest it is so then I can go and look back at it. But I'm pretty sure we haven't. It was big when we seen Lorium, and it was even bigger when we seen El Reino. But other than that, like, like there hasn't necessarily been the other two that we know are supposed to be majorly important. And I'm curious if we'll ever actually see what they are, you know, going to entail in the future. Because if it's not Union Cross, then what, you know? It's interesting, though. I like this. And, of course, Brain does his little thing at the end where he tips his cab. I like that. That's a That was a good... That was a really good um, update quest. Now, the question is, when is the la If you guys know, when's the last update going to be? I think it's around May, obviously. Because um, this is my birthday month, in case anyone wanted to know. If you want to know the birthday. It's in... Uh, well, how many days is it? I know it's May 4th. I just... Yes, may the fourth be with you. Please do not do that to me. <laughs> I know I'm going to get that, though. But, yeah, uh, this was a really good update. I enjoyed this. I'm excited what the actual finale will be, you know, because it seems like there's a lot of juicy stuff to still to come in this. And for it to be the finale and just one more part, I think. I think there's one more part. I don't think there's three, but still. This was a very good update, so I'm excited for the next one and... You know, say like I say, I always say, say what you want about this game. Yes, the gameplay might not be good. Maybe you just don't like the way the game is. It's a gotcha game. But when it comes down to it, the story from this was very, very good. And, and I mean, leave it to the, you know, leave it to the more to keep us coming back, looking forward to just seeing the, seeing a little twenty minute quest line of just little bits and pieces of information that are just so pivotal. Like, I would have never guessed that the what we know now as lifeboats would come back, even though seeing those in Kingdom Hearts 1, I just, just I thought that was just a random room. Probably at the time it was, but to just make a callback to that now is insane. And, I mean, 
I mean, that was just cool to see. But what would be awesome is the final update, they decide to maybe announce something crazy. Like, maybe not announce something crazy, but maybe to announce, I don't know, give us a secret ending sort of cutscene where somehow, I don't know how they would do it. I don't know if you even can. But have an update to the game. That's going to be a big update. Like, it, it's going to murder your phone data. But, like, then you download it, and all of a sudden you do the last quest line, and then it has a pre-rendered cutscene ready for you. And it maybe just has a nice cutscene getting you ready for, obviously, Phase 2 of Kingdom Hearts, but also just getting you ready of what's to come with, you know, who made it. Because, obviously, these people, the four that you just seen... And including probably a fifth one that that we'll probably end up seeing in the next cuts or the next update. But four people made it into the world, and we don't know if Brain is Ericus or Brain is someone else. You know, obviously we know Lorium, Ventus, and Elrena. You know, we know their whereabouts, but still, like this is this is cool. I mean, I, I love what story that this brought, and I'm excited to see what they do because I mean, just imagine. They somehow pull off a pre-rendered cutscene on your phone, and you're just like, oh my, I uh, wasn't expecting this, and then you're just sitting there glued to your screen, just watching it and all, because, I mean, leave it to Nomura, he could do that, you know, that'd be awesome to see, but hope you guys enjoyed this video, I will try to upload more if there's more Kingdom Hearts related stuff, there were probably, I, I would assume, I did say, like, as Union Cross ends, it would be probably the beginning of more information to come for the future of like Kingdom Hearts stuff. So I'm hoping that is the case. But I'm going to try to upload more as time come, goes by. But you know, work's been busy. I started collecting uh, Pokemon cards. I don't know if anyone really necessarily cares about that. But I mean, uh, that's kind of what I've been doing as well. And just playing Call of Duty, doing all sorts of other stuff. But overall, I've uh, just been chilling, you know figuring out if I ever wanted to upload and eh, here's an upload by the time you guys see this it'll be like probably three in the afternoon but for me it's 10 a.m just got off work a nice 12 hour shift I'm tired but I needed to watch this before I went to bed I could not skip out on it but yeah hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did leave a like subscribe and you guys know the drill I will see you guys later